Okay, so what is once again up everybody on YouTube? This is True Bros Gaming HD coming straight at you with yet again another video this Tuesday evening. I hope you guys are doing good out there and I hope you make sure to work hard and I hope also you watch my previously video this day. Because today we got a new mod and we also got some new upcoming mods that I'm going to showcase in this video. So please go ahead and smash the thumbs up right here to show your appreciation to all the mod creators, creators, creators out there using the time to make mods for us right here in the game. And I gotta say right here again, it's totally free. Also, subscribe to my channel, Tubers Gaming HD, by clicking the red button under this video. That would be really cool too. So, as you've probably seen on the screen right now, I have the picture of the mods that is currently in the kind of testing area at Giants and at Farmers Mirror 2019. So we have a lot of new things coming on right here. There is like I think that's actually like uh, 24 PC, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, and 22 new mods in testing for PC. For the PS4 and the Xbox One, which are the kind of parts of lower on that we have one two three four five six new mods actually waiting on that list so right now we actually got one of these on the list for the ps4 and the xbox one which is the kroger aquiline hkd 302 that is already out in the mod section on your ps4 and on your xbox one i already did a review on that so you can go ahead and check out the previously uploaded video if videos if you haven't done that of course but six new mods kind of waiting to be or kind of in the testing area right here and we have 198 mods waiting to be tested of course so that is a lot of new things uh, that is actually on the wait list of the testing area so uh, 198 that's a lot of mods actually so if you're going to go to the first one right here we can actually set out the first one, which is the buying station all food, as you can see on the picture right here. I guess that the buying station all food is basically a station where you can buy all food. Obviously it is, but you can actually buy whatever you want right here. And it is going to be some sort of silo, I think some sort of silo thing that you can actually place wherever you want it. And then you can go over there to buy your stuff and your different kind of things, which I do indeed kind of think is pretty cool, of course, that you can go ahead and do that. And that is like my pure opinion on that, of course. You guys can correct me if I'm wrong. You, uh, you are all able to go ahead and hit a uh, kind of comment in the comment section, of course, if you haven't done that. Uh, and you can kind of exp express your feelings, express, your f express yourself. No, you can actually go ahead and express your feelings on what you think about these mods that is out there right now. And I think it would be pretty, pretty cool if you actually want to go ahead and do that. Leave a comment down under to, to kind of tell what you think. Because it's always cool to see others' opinions on things, I have to say. So yeah. If you have to head right this again to the next one, it is the Do 24 trailer, as you can see right here on the screen right now. The Do 24 trailer, I don't know if this is the correct mod as it is gonna be, but I can't search for it on Google and stuff like that. And this is actually what it comes up with when I search for the Do 24. But it also comes up with different kind of other setups for wagons and uh, kind of low bit wagons. So I guess maybe this is not going to be the one, but I surely hope so. We had this one in 2017 of Farm Simulator as you know it. And uh, it was pretty cool back then. So why wouldn't it be cool right now? I don't actually know. I actually like this low bit wagon a lot, of course. And I uh, surely hope that you guys do the same thing. So, without further ado, I think definitely we should go ahead and hit to the next picture that I do have. 
Um, the next picture or the next mod that is actually testing right now is the heating plant. I think that the heating plant, as you can see on the screen right here, is basically maybe from Lizard, I don't know, but it is a plant station that you can actually just kind of go around with. And I do think it's pretty dope that you can actually just, it's, it's a place able so you can actually just set it wherever you want to set it, of course. And all in all, I think that is pretty cool, of course, and uh, pretty dope. So um, that is pretty, pretty freaking dope, uh, I, I have to say. And I just think that it's going to be as it is going to be. And um, yeah, you can basically just go ahead and buy the things that you want, which is cool. Uh, you, I cannot say any more else than that, of course then I do believe that it is going to be great when this lizard heating plant is kind of going to come out. But once again, I don't know if it is going to look like this, but surely hope so. Once again, right here, we do have yet again another one that is testing right here. This is the one on the list that is called high level rack. I don't yet again know if this is the right one or exact one that is going to come out there. But once again, as I said a million times in this video, I surely hope so. Because it's looking quite cool, this. It's looking quite cool. And that is kind of what I focus about the most when I get into these certain kind of things. Because right here, I gotta say that it's, it's just a placeable rack, actually, or shell shelf if you can actually say that where you can place your stuff and different kind of things and uh yeah that's just cool to see and that's just cool and dope to to watch of course so uh, that's a great thing that's really a great thing that i'm definitely happy to see is gonna be in here so um yeah i think without further ado we should basically just hit to the next one right here which is the silage fork. Again, I don't know if, if this is going to be the exact one that's going to come out, but this is actually a silage fork that is put on the JCB. It looks very familiar to the one that we already got earlier last week. So if it, this is going to be the one, I don't actually know. But as you can see right here, the JCB is on it and the silage fork is in front of it and it is indeed looking freaking amazing. And that is something that I actually focus about the most because I want a streamlined kind of like setup on my farm because I want it to look great. I really, really want it to look as I want it. So um, right there, we do have the silage fork, which is also going to be my thumbnail. Right here, least but not last, we have the last one of today from our the PS4. And as you probably can see right now, this is the Kirkaliner Aquiliner. Kirkaliner Aquiliner for the Tibber section thing. And we got this mod earlier today and I surely hope that you're already out there playing with it or at least just testing it out because it looks pretty cool right here, the Kirkaliner. I don't know how to pronounce it, but I guess it is almost right that I do it like that. I do it like that. Boom, 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 boom. No, I don't know, but it is actually out there, which is, as I wanted to say, pretty cool, of course. So, yeah, that's kind of what we do have right here at the moment. And those are the ones that is in testing for Farm Simulator 2019 on PS4 and Xbox One. So let me know what you guys think about these kind of mods that is right here. Do you think they're great? Do you think they're bad? Is there anything that you actually would have wanted a little bit more than this? Let me know in the comment section below, of course. And without further ado, I think definitely you should go ahead and hit the thumbs up on this video if you haven't done yet. Also, once again, if you're not yet a subscriber to Tuberous Gaming HD, definitely go ahead and subscribe to the channel by clicking the red button under this video and then you actually be subscribed, which is also pretty cool. So, yeah, I think that's basically it. If you have a comment, definitely go ahead and post it in the comment section down under. I'll try to answer it. And also, just in general, go ahead and 
kind of shout out me to your friends if you think it's great content right here. Thanks for watching, guys, and thanks for being here. We're going to see you guys tomorrow, which is another daily upload. Bye, guys. Bye.